Hey folks, Yellowstone is in the news this weekend, and for the exact reason we most often discuss that volcano, and for one of the reasons we worry much, much more about other mountains on Earth. In a beautiful signature of the best supervolcano pressure release system on our planet, the most complex hydrothermal system on Earth has let Steamboat Geyser go off for the third time this year. It goes off every few months, but the last time it went off three times in one year was 2003. It does indeed happen every 10 to 20 years. Now to answer the most critical question, which also touches on the number one misunderstanding about Yellowstone, this is a sign of peace at the caldera overall, not an eruption to come soon. One of the best ways to tell that this and similar volcanoes are getting ready to blow is that the water dries up at the lithosphere or gets cut off underground by deformation, collapses, or chamber filling. The extra geyser events at Steamboat this year are telling that the hydrothermal system is healthy, acting to help cool the caldera and release pressure slowly, and not at all indicating that major changes are taking place beneath the ground. The reason why we are terribly concerned about Campi Flegri in Italy, numerous mountains in Central America, and across the sea in the Indonesia and Papua New Guinea areas, rather than Yellowstone, is because Yellowstone does have an unmatched pressure release system. Geothermal heating of that water and of the ground itself combines with annual earthquake swarms that refuse to allow pressure to build up and pop in a big one. You can learn some excellent details on why, for all the real worry about volcanoes you hear from me, I moved next door to Yellowstone feeling safe as can be. Watch the interview we did on Suspect Sky Channel, it is linked below this video. The point here is that it is basic Yellowstone geology that when the water dries up and geysers stop popping, we could be seeing big changes underneath and pressure building up rather than venting out slowly over time. Below this video, we also have some links to reasons not to forget about volcanoes as they are indeed poised to be a big part of our future. I will see you in the morning. Be safe, everyone.